Hi everyone, my name is Maria Key and today I'm going to talk about what are blockchain nodes and why are they crucial for crypto. I am working as a business development manager at GetBlock, a leading blockchain nodes provider. We offer ready-made nodes for decentralized applications of all types. In this speech, I'm going to briefly cover the concept of blockchain nodes provider and explain why a web-free segment badly needs out-of-the-box nodes API. Also, I will demonstrate the basics of our services stack and touch some points of roadmap. What is a blockchain node and why does the web-free sphere need it? Blockchain or distributed ledger is a permissionless decentralized network that contains replicated shared synchronized digital data geographically spread across multiple computers. Unlike centralized databases, blockchains can be controlled by centralized entities or different administrators. No participant can corrupt the process of data storage, transfer exchange within the blockchain. The blocks contain the information about transactions that take place between the accounts of blockchain. Nobody can replace the next block with the previous one or voluntarily add a new block. It will be rejected by its peers with the network. The network participants add new blocks to the chain. They agree about the fact that the information about the transactions is valid. Simply put, every new block in the blockchain is agreement signed by all computers active within the blockchain. Hereby, we agree that account A has transferred X tokens to account B so that both accounts have their balance changed. Once blockchain nodes participants add a new block to the network, it's permanently connected to the previous one. Every next block contains the information about the previous one, so called header. It guarantees the security and censorship resistance of the entire system. The integrity of blockchain systems are protected by the sophisticated toolkit of hashes. It's like a secrets used to encrypt the data about blocks and transactions. What does this mean for application developers? Blockchains can be used as the elements of reliable, censorship-resistant, attack-resistant and transparent centralized backend for apps. Imagine Google Cloud or Amazon Web Service without centralization, but with battle-tested security and encryption. For instance, Bitcoin works like a clockwork over 12 years without a second of downtime. Different blockchains work in accordance with different rules. We call them types of consensus. Bitcoin, the first ever blockchain, works on proof-of-work consensus, so does a theorem. This means that millions of computers in their networks are trying to solve puzzles in order to mine correct hash of the block. Net number of hashes that computers, like all miners, send to the network is called hash rate. Imagine right here Bitcoin participants worldwide are sending 200 quintillions of hashes every second to protect the integrity of its network. In proof of stake, validators, network participants responsible for proper confirmation of transactions and adding new blocks are keeping network integrity by their stakers, not by computational power contributed. In an upcoming Ethereum 2.0, validators will be required to stake lock a predetermined period of time to two authors. Should one of them somehow fail in the validating process, he or she will be penalized and lose share of the stake. Largest proof-of-stake network Cardano works similarly. Despite the different blockchains having different consensus designs, each of them 
in its daily operation relies on the distributed infrastructure of nodes. We can better imagine a node as a server, actually a computer, <laughs> operated by a specific software. Unlike centralized databases, nodes are equal to each other and contribute equally to the process of blockchain validation and therefore to the confirmation of blockchain transactions. That said, uh, blockchain nodes are geographically distributed elements of computational hardware and software infrastructure required for blockchains to operate. Public nodes and self-hosted nodes what option is a smart bet for 2022? To ensure a balance, a tech-resistant and centralized consensus by decentralized, in this particular case uh, we mean protected from whales domination and 51% attacks. Every blockchain relies on its own ecosystem of nodes. Every ecosystem boasts different levels of nodes with different rights. This feature is also designed to ensure maximum resources efficiently for every participant of node consensus. As we have already mentioned, every blockchain has its own design of node infrastructure. However, typically blockchains use regular nodes and master nodes that leverage more powerful computers and bear greater responsibility. Let's talk about the most popular nodes hierarchy uh, designed with light nodes, full nodes and archive nodes. Light nodes or red-only nodes are the smallest and the most flexible elements of every blockchain infrastructure. Their rights are limited. Uh, they can just check the state of the blockchain, you know, like light nodes can see the balance of accounts, the content of blocks, the status of validators and so on. In their operations they need to get synchronized with full nodes. Light nodes work with minimum software or hardware requirements as they store a small piece of information. For the majority of blockchains, light nodes can be set up in less than one hour even on a low-key computer. Full nodes or master nodes not only store the full information about the blockchain, but also can ingest and save it. Every piece of information stored in the blockchain is added by full nodes or minor nodes in the proof-of-work blockchains. While preserving the blockchain state, the full nodes are synchronized with each other. They store a large amount of information. For instance, Ethereum full node size in GATH implementation is over 750 GB. Technically, full nodes store the copies of all transactions that took place in this or that blockchain. Also, archive nodes store the entire history of the blockchain operations since its first ever mainnet block. Say, with Ethereum archive node, we can track the history of all blocks, balances, accounts, miners and hashes since July 2015. Primarily, uh, we need such nodes for R&D and, and analytical process. Simply put, the majority of blockchains consist of light, full and archive nodes that have different rights and obligations in transaction verification. It takes high-end hardware, sophisticated software and engineering skills to run full and archive blockchain nodes. Since the inception of blockchain technology, crypto enthusiasts have been running various of nodes on their own. For doing so, they receive bonuses in native cryptocurrency for this or that blockchain. Also, to deploy a decentralized application, non-custodial exchange, decentralized lending protocol, on-chain game or NFT marketplace, developers need the access to the blockchain. In the first phases of the DeFi revolution, it was reasonable to run a self-hosted node. In order to have your own node operating, you need to lend a server or data center, customize software, periodically update it and so on. Also, some server infrastructure providers don't allow the installation of node software 
due to regulatory and technical restrictions. That said, running a self-hosted blockchain node might be an interesting and profitable hobby, but it takes too many resources and skills nowadays. It still makes sense for the validators who are only interested in getting reward, though their contribution to distributed compilation infrastructure. For blockchain developers of 2022, running self-hosted nodes is unnecessary. Now they can book an API endpoint created and maintained by a blockchain node provider. As such, developers don't need to rely on self-hosted nodes any longer. Blockchain nodes providers can do all for the heavy lifting and allow blockchain teams to better focus on development and marketing tasks. Gets block stack of nodes, plus 40 blockchains, shared and dedicated nodes, free, paid and unlimited tariffs. Dear guests, the right moment has come to introduce GetBlock, a veteran blockchain nodes provider that provides decentralized applications with reliable and low-cost API endpoints. With our APIs, decentralized applications of all types including Red Hot, Gamify, Play2Earn and NFT protocols can be released in a plug-and-play manner. Launched in early 2019 by a heavy-hitting team of cryptocurrency enthusiasts, GetBlock has a geographically distributed network of servers that allows us to run various nodes of them. That being said, every client of GetBlock can access this infrastructure through an API key. Why does this make sense? It accelerates the speed of app deployment. With GetBlock, Cryptocurrency entrepreneurs can skip the process of node customization. Instead, we offer a ready-made decentralized backend for every dApp. GetBlock's node stack is a scalable one. Crypto teams can experiment with various blockchains, different tariffs plans, and so on. Then working with GetBlock advances the reliable and scalable of every wallet, NFT marketplace, or targeting bot. Our infrastructure is battle-tested, so it's much safer to work with us instead of using self-hosted nodes. While we offer customized service, level agreement for every client, our nodes work with 99% uptime per average. Gets block ecosystem of servers includes high-end data servers in Asia, Europe, and the United States. That said, GetBlock's nodes won't be affected uh, by anti-crypto attacks in various regions of the world. Gats Block Toolkit of blockchains is among the most impressive in the segment. Unlike its major competitors, GetBlock offers APIs of both programmatic blockchains – they support smart contracts – and non-programmatic ones. We offer access to veteran blockchains such as a Bitcoin, Litecoin, XRP, Ledger, and Null Ecosystem, Moonbeam, Moonriver, Ton. Layer 1 giants Ethereum, Solana, Cardano, Phantom, and Cutting Edge Second Layer Solutions, Optimism, and Arbitrum. In a world, GetBlock is a blockchain node provider that offers API endpoints to plus 40 blockchains, including all major smart contracts platforms. Working with GetBlock will save the time and resources of every DAP team and contribute to its decentralization and attack resistance. GetBlock is offering a flexible set of opportunities for decentralized application of all types and sizes. That's why our services stack includes various alternatives to meet the requirements of clients with different budgets. Shared blockchain nodes and dedicated blockchain nodes are two main categories of services we are proudly offering to our clients. Our shared nodes clients can use node servers together with their peers. The number of requests to shared nodes is therefore limited. Typically, we recommend shared nodes as an entry-level option for early-stage dApps with low traffic. Shared nodes can be useful for testing and R&D purposes. 
Also, for experimental purposes, we offer APIs for testnets of Bitcoin, Ethereum, Polkadot, Polygon, and others. For our new shared nodes clients, we offer a free tariff plan. Up to 40,000 requests to the blockchain can be authorized free of charge. This package is enough to demonstrate that opportunities get block unlocked for web free developers. Paid tariff plans started at $6 per 500 requests, while unlimited tariff plans started from $500 per month. Dedicated nodes APIs are our premium level product. Their clients can leverage the technical capacity of specific server for their purpose. The pricing and details of this offer can be discussed with our sales representatives. Every user of our dedicated node gets unlimited requests, premium 24-7 support, easy-to-use analytical dashboard, access to the blockchain through various API interfaces, JSON RPC, uh, WebSockets, and uh, GraphQL, and the opportunity to deploy third party software on our infrastructure. Our dedicated nodes uh, work with 16 thread CPUs, 64GB DDR4, RAM, and high end NVM SSDs. For some of our most popular nodes, Ethereum, Solana, and Polygon, we introduce a 2 plus 1 promo campaign. For every two months of contract, teams get one month of free unlimited requests. Last but not least, we can roll out an archive node for every analytics and trading platform. For our customized archive nodes, clients can reach the full history of blockchain's operation to track performance of crucial trading indicators, on-chain metrics, and other things. This information can provide DApps teams with valuable insights. So, with GetBlock, you can deploy your DApp to any of plus 40 blockchains, mainnets and testnets, shared and dedicated nodes, and various API interfaces are available at low price. GetBlock for blockchain developers explores consulting, not clusters. Despite customized APIs for blockchain nodes represent the top category of our services, GetBlock allows the Web3 family to leverage its blockchain as a server's expertise in a player of ways. First, GetBlock can create a user-friendly explorer for every decentralized network. Blockchain explorers work not unlike browsers for blockchains. They demonstrate the information about all the events in this or that blockchain in a human-readable form. Say, with Blockchain Explorer, everyone can create an invoice to verify crypto transaction, check his or her counterparty and track crucial indicators of blockchain performance. As such, having customized and fast blockchain explorer significantly increases credibility and transparency of every decentralized network. In quarter 2, 2022, GetBlock created a ready-made explorer for Neo Protocol, one of the most sophisticated blockchain ever. The GetBlock team received a NEO Foundation grant and developed NEO Explorer from scratch. This was a huge milestone for our team, as it strengthened our position as a leading blockchain as a service vendor in Web3. Then, from 2022, GetBlock offers Node Cluster building service for its most sophisticated clients. Node Cluster is an ecosystem of nodes designed to handle heavy traffic when a single node is overloaded. With our Node Clusters, decentralized applications can increase their TPS metric and eclipse all competitors by performance and resource efficiency. GetBlock can build both single blockchain and multiple blockchain node clusters 
All NAT clusters are equipped with custom-made load balancing system and alert mechanism. As a per the estimation of our team, working with GetBlock nodes clusters can save 27% of resources. Finally, uh, GetBlock is backing web free entrepreneurs with consulting support regarding technical progress, development, marketing, and other issues. In GetBlock, we have dozens of crypto veterans on board, so we are happy to fuel new teams with our expertise. First of all, we can consult newcomers on how to manage blockchain nodes for better performance and resource optimization. To sum up, GetBlock is a top-tier blockchain-as-a-service platform that connects the centralized application to the endpoints of plus 40 blockchains. Every team, regardless of its budget, mission, vision, and product design, can deploy the next web-free unicorn to our nodes. Thank you for your attention. Stay tuned with GetBlock.